and we tech is back once again and I'm gonna teach you a few well one quick thing really we'll teach you how to use your PlayStation 3 controller with your smartphone I have a Note 8 so if you have a Note 8 this definitely will work you don't need to root your phone this might work on older models I'm not sure you can give it a try you will need a few things you will need this adapter actually came with my phone so um, it's just a simple USB to USB-C adapter this came with my Note 8 I can just go ahead and put that in and it'll be good you need a wire for your PlayStation 3 you can order it on eBay it'll cost like two or three bucks I'll put a link in the description so you can um, buy it from eBay and also you will need a couple of apps some common sense and you will need to follow these steps exactly and don't forget subscribe thumbs up and I'm gonna put a link for my patreon also I have a couple of things on sale an angry tech mug angry tech bag and an angry tech shirt so be sure to visit my patreon at the angry tech Visit my Facebook at the Angry Tech. Twitter me at the Angry Tech One. All right, so here we are on our Android phone. We're gonna download three apps. All right, so the first one is going to be downloaded from the web browser on your phone. All right, so we're gonna go. I prefer Google Chrome, so we're gonna go there. Now we're gonna download an app called Black Market Alpha or black market yeah exactly what's called black market alpha type that in you're just going to go to the first link www.blackmart.us click on the very first link that you see uh, what black market alpha is it's just like a google play but you get to download free paid apps not all apps are free like you can't download final fantasy or download any other you know expensive games from there but you can download a few apps for free that are paid and you're just gonna scroll down a little bit you're gonna scroll down until you see uh, the black market alpha screenshot right here and go a little bit more down and you're gonna see in blue lettering download black mart so that's what we're gonna do we're gonna download black mart it's gonna be right here where you see the little uh ball at you're gonna download that you're gonna download go ahead I already have it downloaded so um, I don't need to open it so I have it downloaded it's right over here black mart the B with the black logo on it all right the second app you're gonna download is gonna be from Google Play as a matter of fact we're gonna download our second app from Black Market Alpha. You're gonna download an app called Six Access. Type in Six Access. It's not called Six Access. You're gonna type that in and you see the second app, Six Access Enabler. We're gonna download that. So go ahead and uh, click on it. I have it already downloaded. Six Access Enabler. That's the, that is the app that you want. Okay. The third app we're going to download is on Google Play. You're going to go in the Play Store. You're going to type in USB. USB OTG checker. This is to check if your device is compatible with the PlayStation 3 controller. That's what this is. So we're going to go ahead and download it. I already have it. So we're going to open it. Once you open it, you'll... you'll you're, you'll, you'll either see it's compatible or it's incompatible. I have a Note 8. My Note 8 is compatible, and I'm pretty sure that plenty of other phones are also com compatible with this. So that are the that is the three apps that you're going to download. We're going to download Black Market Alpha from the web browser. The second app we're going to download is going to be in Black Market Alpha. You're going to download the 6-axis enabler, and you're going to download the USB 
TG Checker. So those are the three apps we're going to download. So now let's go to, to my phone, to the phone, and let's see how this works. All right, so here we are on our phone. We're going to go ahead and just uh, connect our wire, our adapter to the USB. And we're going to take our USB and we're going to attach it to our phone. And we're going to take this end of the USB and we're going to put it in the PlayStation like so. Next thing we want to do is we want to go ahead and go into our brand new app. Excuse me. There it is. Six Access Enabler. Right there. And we're just going to say yes. And uh, we're just going to take our PlayStation button and press it make sure that it's blinking and as you can see this there's, there's a message that comes up now look it you can test it out and as you can see it works so that's fine now what I like about this app is when you play a game it configures the controls itself so let's test it to see if it works first let's go ahead I like to test this out on uh, the arcade emulator MAME because we have Street Fighter, Mortal Kombat and those are games that you need a controller to use so let's go ahead and uh, let's put this in uh, that mode and of course we have our clamp our mobile clamp but I'm not going to use that just yet I'll have a quick demonstration so we're gonna play Street Fighter Alpha 3, that's my favorite game, so let's just go ahead and uh, do that. Now, let's just go ahead and uh, see if this works. Now, also what you wanna do is, before you play any game, of course you wanna go into your settings and get rid of the uh, touchscreen controls. And uh, let's go ahead and test it out. Oh yeah, baby. That light in the way, I don't like it. Jesus. Okay. See, and it works. That's it. That's it. Whoops. But this app works. And it works pretty good. All right, so we tested out the uh, app, and it does work. Now, all you have to do is subscribe. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe. Don't forget to visit the Patreon, the Angry Tech, Twitter, Facebook, everything. Just do it. Tell your friend to tell a friend to tell a friend, and make sure... You tell a friend.